In case you didn't know, I have an independent music project called Nethracetacon. I have officially been recording since 2005, but it has only been recently that I decided to use the wonderful internet to post my music online. To be honest, there was something specific that caused me to finally release my demos on Bandcamp and SoundCloud. This was the sixth Rob Zombie album that dropped in spring of 2016. I had been a fan since his White Zombie days in the early 90s, but when I heard this new stuff, I was hooked. The album title is quite a mouthful. In one sense, I can barely believe that they actually decided on it. The Electric Warlock Acid Witch Satanic Orgy Celebration Dispenser. Very over the top and ridiculous. Exactly as it should be. Like shock rock stream of consciousness with no filter at all. For such a lengthy, outrageous name, the record is surprisingly short, just under 32 minutes. Most bands would consider a selection like this to be more of an EP, but not Rob Zombie. Nope, it's a full-length album. He also has an incredible lineup right now. John Five on lead guitar and Ginger Fish on drums. Not only are they both phenomenal musicians, interestingly, they both previously played with Marilyn Manson another one of my all-time favorite music artists. They all seem just as enthusiastic about things as they did more than 20 years ago. Now, also being a famous film director, Rob Zombie has never shied away from making memorable music videos. I give him and his crew a lot of credit for this, and it's just very smart from a business perspective. I first caught wind of Zombie's sixth album via YouTube. He decided to shoot videos for most of the important songs, and to my amazement, all of them are very different and very creative. If you are into groove metal and campy horror movies, you will simply love this stuff. There is practically everything you could ever want here. Sex, drugs, rock and roll, zombies, vampires, aliens. And that's just the beginning. Seriously, I dig everything about this album. From the musicians, to the presentation, to the sound. Just like Ozzy, Alice Cooper, and all the forefathers of hard rock and metal, Rob Zombie is truly a unique performer. I admire his wacky style and tireless perseverance over three decades now. This record kind of got me back into music again. At a time when I didn't even know I needed something fresh, and I thought I had heard it all. When I went down to Best Buy to purchase a copy of the CD, the guy told me it was their last one. That makes it even more special to me, and I'm thrilled that other people not only heard about it, but drove down to the store to buy the thing, just like me. So, for my verdict... I give the Electric Warlock Acid Witch Satanic Orgy Dispen Celebration Dispenser a solid 9 out of 10. I'm serious, you guys. You've got to listen to this record. It has given me a new perspective on what a release can be. And when this album dropped, I finally decided to put... Nethrocedicon's music online. Now, please uh, do a search for Nethrocedicon. The best place to find my stuff is on my Bandcamp page, or you can look at Nethrocedicon on Facebook, Twitter, WordPress, SoundCloud, YouTube. Um, everybody just give me some support here you know if i start gaining followers and plays i will release more music i've got a ton of stuff so nethrocedicon that's the name everybody all right peace out okay here she is
Look at this cat. She's showing us her cat feet. So stinky. Jack. Sabotage Captain them Jack's within the family system. Here's Jack. We just drove to Houston and, and had a whole ordeal with Simone's that's the other thing. Why does mom and and and, 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 and and stole her away and then Kayla yeah, was in the car and she was freaking out. But we're back now and we had a safe trip and, and uh here's Cap and Jack. Jack, you got anything to say for the viewers? about the horrible things they did to you and secretly what you're no. really saying is I wish you'd own what you did to me take responsibility for it and now you got anything properly. to say for the camera Jack? I'd say guess again because that's not going to happen that camera screen the key is if you're confronting them to know why you're doing it and if you're expecting them to love you at all then you're barking up the Cap wrong tree Cap and Jack on the other hand Cap and Jack Sparrow Cup and Jack, oh, Cup and Jack. Really good to your parent for what they've done to you. They often drop their mask, and you get a chance to really see who they are. Cup and Jack, Cup and Jack Sparrow. 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 Cup